Good afternoon. Thousands of oil and gas workers in New Mexico have been underpaid more than $1 million. The U.S. Department of Labor wants those workers to get the money they deserve. News 13 Cheyenne Cope is live in our Roswell Bureau, where most of the region relies on the oil and gas industry. Jessica, more than 1,300 workers are owed more than $1.3 million. This was discovered after the U.S. Department of Labor's Wage and Hour Division launched an enforcement initiative last year. The division found a number of violations that left workers underpaid. Department officials say that there are many reasons for the problem, one being that the workers don't even know that the law is being violated. When there are workers who need earnings and there are opportunities for them to make earnings, uh, and then when they don't quite understand what the law entitles them to and assures they should get, you get an environment where this kind of problem can uh, uh, pop up. The department found that some employees were working up to 100 hours a week and only making a daily rate, which means in some cases they weren't even making minimum wage. Jessica, back to you. All right, thank you, Cheyenne. The division also found companies were treating employees as independent contractors, saying workers were their own small business. The Labor Department is now forcing companies to pay up the money they owe. Looks like